Good morning, people. It is about 9 o'clock in the morning and I'm out on my little ride. What I want to share with you people this morning is this. <laughs> Around uh, every February, March, what happens? The almond trees are in blossom. Yeah, ain't that cool? Ain't that neat? <laughs> A lot of almond trees <clears throat> here in California in this part of the territory anyway. They say that, uh, you know, California is full of nuts and fruits. Well, there you go. Almond trees. Boy, a lot of them. Some old, some new. And here's an interesting fact. See, there's a young almond tree uh, orchard. And uh, I guarantee you, those are self-pollinating. Yes, you do not need bur uh, bees to pollinate your almonds no more. Isn't that amazing, huh? The old trees, you still do. But the new trees, you do not. Going up here and... But look at all those almonds. That is uh, well, more Avenue, by the way. Looks like some more, or an orchard going in there or something, huh? <laughs> but yeah, a lot of trees. And it takes about a gallon of water for each nut. Sounds like a lot, don't it? Now I think up here, So what I'm coming to is a uh, net place. It's a harvester. It's a net company. And uh, yeah, it's the almonds. Hope you can see that. A holer and chiller. <clears throat> so they bring in the almonds here in trucks. And that's where they... Uh, extract the meats, the nuts, from the shells. You know, trucks like that. Isn't that amazing? <laughs> A lot of almond trees. More over there. Let's see what road this is. Silver Road. Okay. And here's a. Look like they're planting an orchard here, too. Hmm. Drip system. That's the only way to do it nowadays, people. But more, more almonds. I don't know how many thousand acres there is in, around this area. But uh, there's a lot of them. People gotta have their nuts. Well, it is uh, 48 degrees out here in the country. A little cooler than in the city. But again, more almonds. Boy, I did my uh, share of uh, knocking almonds in my day. My little kid, uh, people put in new almond trees. And you know, they were gonna be producing for three or four years, uh, heavy. So I'd uh, go around and I'd uh, knock all the, uh, little almond nuts off the trees, put them in gunny sacks. You people remember gunny sacks, don't you? <laughs> and take them to Hag Barbarian. It is a nut place in Modesto where they uh, would extract the uh, nuts from the shells. And uh, they'd either buy my nuts or I'd sell them on the street. <laughs> Something that I was doing when I was a kid to make money. Why not? It's my thing. Uh oh, one way to rain broke again. But look at all those blossoms, huh? Wow. Again, one gallon of water is what it takes to produce a nut. <clears throat> I wonder what they're doing here. 
We'll find out, won't we? Well, and then on the other hand, over here, what we have is walnuts. Yeah, bad time to shoot into the sun, Chuck. There we go. Uh, walnut trees. This is fairly young. Uh, and one thing I noticed nowadays, they plant these trees, the vineyards, closer together than they used to. You know, get more per acre that way. Okay, going slow. Looks like they pruned a uh, walnut tree there. Look at them, see? Isn't that nice? Yeah, did more good, buddy. Let's see what they're doing here. Ah, uh, they're doing some road work. Looks like they're widening the, uh, the road. And there again, there's some young almond tree fields, and they are self-pollinating. So watch for the bees, baby. Oh, my window, sorry about that. Hello, school buses. But isn't that amazing? And uh, all this is uh, done by machine nowadays course you got uh, these machines go through here and shake these trees for grab hold of them and just shake them then they got a sweeper that comes along and sweeps them up then they put them up in the truck into the room Let's see what street this is key road how about that keys it's one of those uh, California sauce by the way <laughs> and more almonds more almonds have more almonds. Isn't that amazing? I mean nuts. <laughs> A lot of nuts. Fruit and nuts in California, what can I say? And on my morning ride, why not? Like I say, I just wanted to show you people how many almond trees are just in this one area. I mean, there's thousands of acres maybe millions of acres of almonds being grown in California and again one gallon per nut <laughs> so there you go and what we have here yeah this looks like a pasture ah some more uh, almond trees I mean the young vines there on trees whatever up here we got a dairy. Yeah, gotta have something to feed those cows, huh? Again, that takes a lot of water too. Well, it don't take a lot of water. Wow. Oh, what can you what we got here? Somebody, uh, you know, these are the old trees. So what they're doing, they knock them over and they use a chipper shredder Spread all that up and plant new trees. You know, they don't only really produce for the oil. Here, we have grapes that are trained to be machine picked. That's how come they're on wires like that. Back in the day, we had to labor, or the farmers had to labor to, uh, you know, hand pick everything. Now they turn to machines. Sign of the times. There's a big bunny of nuts growing. What do you think? It has to be, huh? All those nuts. <laughs> okay, well, we're coming up here to Crow's Landing Road. Crow's Landing Town is that right away. Okay. Well, that's a bit of an old garage that's been there forever. Looks like it's not no more. Comes a guy in a tractor. Big fork clip on the front. Looks like 
got a lot of high bushes there hiding something. This is Keys Road. Nice farmhouse, huh? Rebel Cracks. Look at that warehouse, huh? Something big. Looks like it could be a winery. Look at the tanks. Those are grapes they're planting there, so probably, yeah, that's probably a winery. I don't know the name. But wine is big in California too. Boy, that cold air feels good. Again, more young by, uh, trees that do not need pollination. Ain't that something else? North Gate. Great trucks, that away. So yeah, anyway. Grapes, nuts. Hauled a lot of grapes, hauled a few nuts. But, uh, <laughs> which reminds me of the story. My dad said, the only, th uh, the only, let's see, how that story go again? Uh, the only thing wrong with that car is a loose nut behind the wheel. So I'll be going back to the home here pretty quick. Time to make some phone calls and see what I can do from there. And more nuts. It is Central Avenue, by the way. And it looks like... Uh, yeah, more trees here, young trees. On drip system. Again, that's the only way to go nowadays. This guy over here, he has, uh, look, he has some sprinklers going. Hmm. Okay. That's a cool shoe. Thanks for watching. We'll see you later. Enjoy your nuts.